Hey, it's Christine the Haunt Girl. Today I'm talking about the ladder. Shout out to Amber for inviting us to play the beta test. Thank you so much. This is the shorter version of my review. There'll be a longer version at thehauntgirl.com and uh, follow me and all that jazz. Okay, here we go. This is a 90 minute experience where you choose between one of five avatars in the first room and you follow that character throughout the story. If you want to just follow the story path, there are puzzles for that. And if you want to follow the path where you just climb the ladder, the corporate ladder, you can also just earn money doing puzzles repeatedly in each of the decades from 1950 up to like 2000. They recommend two to 12 players. It's a minimum of four players to book. I think four is absolutely the minimum of people you should bring, even for enthusiasts. 12 probably still has plenty to do. Uh, if you want to do both tracks, the puzzle track for the story and the puzzles to earn money, you probably need at least six people that are very skilled puzzle people. It is 75 to $95, depending on when you go and it's in Los Angeles, California. The set design is incredible. I love how they played with the lighting and the sound. The puzzles are uh, very diverse. I didn't see it completed. It was still in its beta test version, so not everything was done, but I still had way more to do than we could handle. And uh, overall, I had a fun time. I'm excited to see what other paths there are and other avatars to play. I definitely, um, was irritated with the villain the entire time. He's very condescending, specifically to the female character we were playing, which felt a little too real to me, uh, but definitely made its point. Uh, overall, I highly recommend going with a large group to check this out. It is something new and unique and fun, and I can't wait to hear what you thought about it too. Thanks for watching.